Hey, how's it going, everybody? Nas here. You're watching Nostalgic Reviews, but um, today's super special, man. Today is uh, from Rob, Rob and Monica in the UK, man, across the pond. Um, okay, so we just did an unboxing of a very generous box that uh, that Rob sent with just amazing gifts, um, you know, very thoughtful gifts things like uh this Ayrton Senna freaking helmet which it's die cast which um almost made me cry uh, on top of other like a fire truck from Philadelphia Fire Department and a bunch of other donations for the next Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction and um so yeah um honestly uh, he sent some um customs guys and those customs one of them's for me I commissioned him and he sure as hell delivered oh my god um but i showed those really quick on the you know the review uh the unboxing channel but i promised to make a separate review video which is this one so we're gonna take a look at four customs from rob 33 dc check him out on instagram guys amazingly amazingly talented freaking artist uh the customs he makes are on a whole other level um i'm a huge fan i have quite a few of his customs i actually have his first custom his number one um which is a, an insane honor and that will be in my collection forever but um <sighs> sorry i'm kind of excited um <laughs> because uh, i really wanted to make this real quick uh, i needed to find some time to do it because you know i'm adult an adult and all that uh so what we're gonna do is we're gonna just jump right into this and get going so uh i'm sorry i'm not doing a turntable to be honest with you i kind of prefer it this way i have two turntables they're loud uh, you kind of don't really have too much uh, control over what it focuses on and you can never really get close enough like you can literally as I'm doing right now basically look at how close we are here the only setback is my fingers are kind of in the way but you know what I think it's okay so uh, let me actually brighten this up a little bit we're all doing this together guys <laughs> there we go uh let me get a little um surface for y'all so what we're gonna do here is use this little bullet box as a little stage for y'all so this is an amazingly detailed um custom that i asked rob to make for me this is too fast too furious roman's freaking car um, just wait, th this is exciting because he didn't just make this car. First of all, look at the headlights. My man cut out holes for where the headlights were and kind of filled them with, uh, I guess, hot glue and other methods. I don't know. It looks amazing. <laughs> he did suggest that I should, um, if I can find more appropriate wheels, like more correct wheels, to go ahead and swap them. For now, I'm going to leave it with what the artist has there. So, yeah. There's a little 33DC. I highly recommend to all custom customizers to mark their customs. Because a lot of you, at least put your initials on there. Uh, because once it's out of your hands, um, people are going to forget eventually. I'm not talking about myself here. but uh, So, here is this beauty man. Look at the little rally art sticker right there. I think he ordered the actual decals from a Ukrainian uh, girl, and uh, which really made me happy. <laughs> Support Ukrainian business. Here's the back. Look at that exhaust pipe, man. But yeah, dude, when I first saw this, I was just like, oh my god, what a beauty. Um, Rob, thank you so much, bro. So yeah, so he made this. Um which is amazing but my man also okay we need to still see that there we go my man also has a friend that does uh stuff like this this is actually a hard board um with card art how cool is this 
Because this is a Hot Wheels custom, I need to specify that. I collect Fast and the Furious Hot Wheels cars. Uh, Hot Wheels does not make this Fast and the Furious version. But they did make the actual car, as you can see, Mitsubishi Eclipse right there. Um, so Rob literally took the uh, the roof off. <laughs> I can't wait till he uh, sends me some photos of the in the progress in the process photos. Hopefully, maybe even videos. Uh, I'll try to get those into this video. If not, I'll just put this video out, and then uh, one day I'll uh, share the other photos. But what's important is <laughs> this is how Rob rolls. Look at this. He put nostalgic on here. This is number 22 uh, from his customs. Now I have, I think, three or four of his other customs, and um, some of my friends have some of his other customs, which is amazing. But uh, there you go. Little note from him and Monica. Thank you guys. Roman's Mitsubishi Eclipse Spider. And I love the metal plate. <laughs> he also includes uh, stickers, a couple of stickers, and a couple of uh, on like uh, nice card paper. So I could either put these, you know, cut these out and put them into a protector and maybe put a little blister on there if I wanted to. But uh, I'm going to frame at least one of these and uh, have it on display with my other card art from him. But uh, all my customs go into a display case. So. I really appreciate him not sealing it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, these things need to be appreciated out of a blister, man. Customs are like a whole different beast, you know what I mean? So yeah, this looks amazing. Let's uh, let's move along to the next one. Uh, you know what? Oh, oops. We are going to start with the card art, and then I'll show you the car. This is the next one. Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction number twenty-one. This will be available, obviously, at the Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. How cool is this? How cool are these little, like... Whoever wins this is going to have this as a very, very, very pleasant memory, man. Another sticker, 33 DC. By the way, these are signed. Number 21 with the signature and the metal plate. There you go. And you have the two cards. And you get two stickers. And here's the truck. <laughs> Ooh, this one, we need to uh, get a little bit darker here. Sorry, there we go. It's a very pearl white beauty. So what Rob does also, <laughs> treasure hunt, how cool is that? Rob's little signature that he does sometimes is, uh, see the wheels on this side are beautiful chrome like that. Check out the wheels on this side. Oh yeah. <laughs> These have a blue line in the middle, which is a very cool look for this truck in particular. So as you can see, that is beautiful. There's your little tags back here. Fantastic exhaust pipe tips add-ons. <laughs> a little, uh... Oop, come on. Trying to zoom in on the rear window here. There you go. You have some detail right here, the NOS bottle, bottle, little chrome accents, fantastic truck, right? If you want to see more close-ups of this, definitely head over to uh, Nostalgic underscore uh, Productions or Hot Wheels for Ukraine with underscores everywhere. I have uh, some beauty shots on there if you want to have a closer look. And this will be available on the next Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. So. Uh, Find out the dates on my Instagram account. And if you want to donate anything, uh, definitely feel free to reach out. There we go. So that is the second one. Ah, 83 Chevy Silverado. Didn't want to mess up the year there. All right. I love what he does with the wheels. <laughs> That's just awesome. All right, next up is one more uh, 83 Chevy Silverado, but it's very different. You can tell by the headlights on the card art here. Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction, number 23. So uh, again, this is signed and numbered. 
with a little metal plaque etched. Look at this beautiful Chevy. I love that the card art is the car, his custom that he made. Like that is a unique thing to do. Like all of the mods and everything are on the card. So like you're truly getting a fully, you know, packaged one of a kind piece with one of a kind art card on the back. Like it, it's intense, man. I love that. Like Rob is a serious collector. He's a serious artist, customizer. Just a good dude, man. Who has a good woman behind him, Monica. <laughs> who we all love. And uh, I can't wait to send uh, Rob and Monica another box so we can um, hook up Monica with a whole bunch of awesome stuff. Let's look at the custom. All right. I mean, how how's, is your breath still in you? In you? <laughs> this took my breath as well. Um, the color, I love this color. Very unique. I hope it's coming through in the video. Chevy Silverado. I love the multiple tags. I think that's awesome. Again, Rob is very unique. He does his own thing. 33 DC. Um, he always takes his customs a step, a step further. You know what I mean? It's not just like whatever. Look at this grill. So like... Custom headlights, just sinister looking Chevy, bro. Look at that. I love when he does stuff like that. And again, as you can see, the wheels, you got red inside of the wheel wells. And on this side, it's just black with red accents in the middle. I love that, dude. Rob, you, you're awesome, dude, for doing that. If you display your card that way, it's a certain way. If you display, display it that way, it's a whole different way. I think that's awesome, man. Variety, it's just great. Whew. Then we have uh, the HKS <laughs> NOS tank back here. Little accents in there as well. Interior does have detail, as you can see. These are next level customs, guys. Like, there's a lot of, oh, there's a lot of customs out there. I have a felt table, so don't. Don't fear that I dropped it. I always have to drop at least one custom. <laughs> There's zero damage. It's literally a pool table uh, cloth that I have here. It's like a soft felt um, thing. So yeah, never fear, man. I got this. I know I dropped stuff. <laughs> so yeah, uh, this is definitely going to be uh, one of the hot items here. Here's a comparison of what... Uh, regular grill looks like and what a all-out custom one does freaking awesome dude i love these both of these are just freaking awesome all right so we saw the two freaking silverados here Oop. just want to make this all look a little bit better and make some room for the one that's going to go on the left here oh so this one's mine which I absolutely love, and Rob, thank you. This was all that I was expecting, actually, guys. But uh, Rob is a generous man, and uh, I am thankful that I know him. I'm thankful to call him my friend. Hopefully, someday we'll meet, hopefully. Uh, it would be awesome to hang out with him and Monica. There's one more car, guys. And um, this one, um, there's a reason I've been saving it for the end. Ah, because it's freaking awesome! Wait till you see it. But I'll show you the card art first so you get a good idea so you're not like God smacked. <laughs> All right, there are two stickers each. There we go. Um, next one's going to be this. You guys like gassers, right? I know there's been a, a craze lately for, uh, for gassers. Jack Daniels, 55 Chevy Bel Air gasser for the Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. So I don't know, whenever you're watching this, you might be watching this after the auction and you won't be able to get these. Uh, if you're watching this before the auction, the auction is March 23rd. It's going to be a Saturday, March 23rd, 2024. Right here on the Nostalgic channel, it's going to be live like every other auction we've ever done. It's live on my channel. Um, rules are coming soon. I might even put them under this video in the description, but simply enough, you need to have uh, PayPal or Venmo, and um, you put in $5 to one of those before the auction starts, which gets you in the auction. It gives you the right to bid. 
And your $5 will go as just a donation, whether you bid or you don't bid. We're raising money for Ukraine. That's the whole point of it. So at, at the very least, you're going to donate 5 bucks. Um, and then that's it. Uh, whatever you win, we're going to add up all the shipping. You still pay for shipping. Uh, but, you know, uh, we're, I'm going to weigh everything out and let you know how much your shipping is total. And it's America only. If you're um, overseas somewhere... Um, you need to contact me personally on one of my Instagram accounts or send me an email and uh, maybe we can work something out but I prefer not to because it's way too much hassle uh, to ship stuff overseas or even to Canada but Canada's not that bad but we do do that for some people just as long as they're uh, buying a lot of stuff like the point is to raise money for Ukraine right guys so again there you go custom signed metal plate but yeah, any questions, let me know. We usually have a lot of fun doing these things. And this time, it's probably going to be just customs. Because, boy, do we have a lot of customs this time around. So we might do two separate auctions. One's going to be just customs. And one might be just all the other awesome stuff we have. Okay, guys. I hope you're ready for this. Because I love this. This is a freaking masterpiece. Let's brighten it up a little bit because we went from white truck to freaking blacked out Jack Daniels. <laughs> there we go. A little bit brighter. Yeah, that's good enough. Okay. So, look at this beauty. Are you looking at that roof? That's right. My man hand sawed <laughs> the roof off. But not just the whole thing. He left a rolling bar roll cage roll bar type of thing for safety <laughs> the detail in the engine insane look at how like nicely the patina but the patina is like not rust it's more like um bronze you know you know what i mean like bronze copper situation going which is so fitting for the whole black black and gold look you know with the jack daniels extremely appropriate so here's the back <laughs> what's that say california jack <laughs> right on that is so cool so again let's go this is the the wheels are blacked out here i'll wait till i get to the grill and then they're gold on this side both sides look freaking amazing i mean I don't know what I can say, but okay, here we go. Look at those headlights, guys. That is like next level marksmanship. My man <laughs> drilled out the headlights, then inserted his own little like pipe situation, whatever he used. And they're like made so nice that it almost looks like there's light bulbs in there. Like, that is next level. Like, it looks like it has adorable little eyes. And then the car's like, yeah, but I'm sinister. <laughs> like, yeah. So, yeah, the details obviously also detailed. And I think just the right way, the right color. This thing is just an all-around perfect little custom. I love this thing so much. So hopefully you guys will uh, be there for the auction. Hopefully you will bid generously. This is for Ukraine, and you get an amazing, you know, um, an amazing custom to show thanks for your support and uh, you caring for people who are suffering right now, who are being invaded. This is like World War II, you know. Um, I'm trying not to say certain words on YouTube. That's why I always have. I always have difficulty saying um, what, you know, what this is for, but there is a war in Ukraine. We're being invaded by Russians. They're committing insane atrocities. There's leveled buildings, leveled cities. Like, it's cratered like the moon from hundreds of thousands of munitions, rockets, drones. Like, civilians are being killed. You know what I mean? Um... It's, it's insane. So what we're trying to do here on the Nostalgic Channel is try to raise 
I guess awareness, but more importantly, people are aware. It's been going on for two years, guys. This awful war has been going on for two years. We're trying to make a difference. We've already sent about $10,000 over two years from these auctions and other charity fundraisers we've done on this channel. I'm very thankful to everyone that's participated so far, to all the customizers that have donated customs for these sales, and everyone that has purchased things on these auctions. I really appreciate all of you. We all appreciate all of you. My Ukrainian contacts are they have no idea how we're doing it with hot wheels because they don't really understand you know the the power of collectors and the, the hot wheels community uh so they're always like oh my god again and again and i'm like yeah man we're not stopping so like they're they're so happy every time we send them money every time we send them donations of toys and hot wheels for ukrainian kids you know the orphaned kids that lost their parents to the war in one way or another um we do everything we can to help Ukraine and Ukrainians, and we give this money directly to volunteers in Ukraine in Lviv. So those guys then take the money and then they get it to where it has to go. <laughs> so, um, you know, mainly, just really quick before we go, mainly this money goes to humanitarian aid. It goes to uh, fuel the cars and trucks that go back and forth between the front lines. Um, those guys uh, are the like they're heroes they're they're in just as much danger as the soldiers their cars get shot up sometimes they get blown up the volunteers lose lives as well so um, yeah so they do that they uh, help uh, clear out people from war zones they also rescue animals they also provide food and shelter for people that need it um, they they just do everything they possibly can and I'm trying to make sure that I send them money so they can keep doing that and for you for you guys and me just to be here to be able to not be in danger and to be able to provide the means for those guys to do what they're willing to do and risk their lives daily all we're doing is sending them money meanwhile we're still having fun we're still doing all this stuff so with that being said, you know, this is the least that we can do. I'm talking about myself and you guys. Like, I'm Ukrainian. For me, this is way more personal. Uh, you guys are her heroes in my eyes for helping, for doing all this, for trusting me. For I, I just, I don't know what to say. You guys are amazing people. So I hope we have a really good turnout um, March 23rd on Saturday. Hopefully you guys will show up with your wallets, you know, and your generosity. Hopefully you will want some of these customs and bid on them. We have so many more. There's more videos coming of amazing customs from other customizers and artists. So stay tuned. And with that, I think that's it. I don't want to say too much, <laughs> but uh, this one's mine. The rest of these are available for the Hot Wheels for Ukraine auction. And as, as you see, uh, they're all they're all amazing this guy is gonna be the star though <laughs> i mean i don't think you guys are gonna argue just a beautiful uh masterpiece all of them are and this thing i'm just so amazed and just in love with uh can't wait to put it in the fast and the furious case honorably as a custom it's gonna go into my main collection as uh not a custom because it's so freaking good and it's from a good friend and a good person and two good people. So yeah, Rob, Monica, thank you guys so much for being amazing people, for making all of this happen. And that's it, man. So yeah, um, Slava Ukraini, Heroyam Slava. Peace and love, everyone. Rob.